Okay, 26, 29 Haddon. Holy mackerel. This place is over the top. Um, the only way to describe why this is available is just a failure to perform as brokers because they're making so much money doing other things. But God bless them. Um, so this one has ridiculous recessed lighting everywhere. It's immaculate. And the drawers. The disposal. I mean, <laughs> it's kind of beyond over the top, right? So I was thinking you should do chestnut, but I don't know how you could considering this. Um, but I don't know what the, there's any type of yard area here. I know there's a deck though. And this is an awesome location. It's so deep, it's so big. It's truly, I mean, where the one on Haddon from yesterday, see that, that line at the window? It ends that, that cut in, that's the extent of their place. But then their living space ended essentially before these windows, okay? So their kitchen was here. None of that existed, right? And they didn't have any of that. The power's turned off. So this is it looking like as dark and shitty as it could. This is a gas and wood burning fireplace. Um, the Juliet balcony out here. It's nice to hear what it sounds like. The parking is amazing here. Oh, wow. I guess I, I'm a sucker for it because it's super clean too, right? Um, these steps, I just keep thinking of all these cool different things you could do there. Um, oh, there's a trash guy going by. So if you have the door open, that would be that. But if you have the air on, then that is not an issue. But like, you could do a dining room table here, bar stools. You could do a dining room table over here, which would be awesome. Um, or do no dining room table, honestly. There's so much room. So like if you had a living room, you know, huge amount of furniture, you have so much room to walk behind it. It's just for this neighborhood that's beyond an anomaly you know it's just they're just built so narrow uh, washer dryer this bedroom this bedroom fits a uh, queen bed dresser this is like the size of the larger bedrooms in that we've seen in wicker park I and mean, this is like the one that we were going to have as the master on artesian um i will send you the exact dimensions but a queen bed could easily go here with nightstands dresser vice versa actually even a king um this is probably oh wow i thought it was your heating and cooling and it's not it's just a ton more storage the broker for this just doesn't seem to care that much and she's been out of town so god bless god bless her failures anyways um so then you walk down this would be your guest bath right um i keep turning on the lights hi i keep trying to think it's gonna work uh it's not and so then here you've got um a really pretty glass enclosed shower it's it's immaculate the caulking everything it's just so neat to see something like that the quarry in here is lovely the inlaid flooring and then all the glass block light letting it in letting the light in this is the master it is crazy again the lights are off so i'm just opening the door here um this here is pretty much a, those two outlets 
or perfect uh, like explanation of a king size bed. So it's kind of perfect because you would you could have a king bed and nightstands and room to walk around and then your bed would come to right right here where these these little um, things in the floor are. that's where the, the bed ended. So then essentially all of this is free space. So it wouldn't be so weird if you had people walk through your bedroom to your outdoor space, but technically they don't have to. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, adjustable closet. These are awesome. So you can, I really like these cause you can add drawers to them. You know, um, you can adjust these. You can have more of the rods. I don't like to fold things so I can have hanging. You can have, you know, shirts, pants, dresses, you could just do a ton of hanging um, ceiling fan. This is your master bath. I'm trying to not get too excited because it's it's just you know again it really shouldn't be here. This jacuzzi. <laughs> this has all these spray jets. I know that's a demanded quality, a demanded amenity for you guys multiple spray decks and um these ugly blinds so you would have to figure out that these are this is a sliding screen door and this is your outdoor space it is <laughs> we're not gonna you can't i can't go on and on and on it's too much so if you went out your back door, that's your actual apartment. So no one actually has to come through your bedroom. They just come this way, boom, right? So you could do a dog gate, um, baby gate. That's what a lot of people do. That's in 99% of the apartments you see what you would do a baby gate here. And that's the story. Um, as far as downstairs, it's a cot. Oh, so that's actually really nice down there. There's lots of gravel. Um, not gravel, like nice stones, fenced in completely. So that's actually pretty nice. Wow. Kind of freaking out. Okay. 